Hi there, this is Hans Forschner with Napkin Engineering. This is a short video in regards to generating embankments uh, for roads in uh, existing topography. Uh, a lot of times if you have a new road built or any kind of changes, uh, you may not have uh, the final topographical um, kind of cuts where the road goes into uh, either in a cut or is on elevated on embankment. Uh, so one way to deal with those situations in regards to the noise propagation modeling is to have sound plan develop those embankments. Uh, here let me kind of visualize that. Um, so here we have a topographical area and then we have a road uh, in this area. I uh, calculated a digital ground model just to visualize the, the situation. And uh, so here we can kind of uh, zoom in and you can kind of see here there is a, uh, a road going winding up uh, a hillside or mountain area and you see there's every now and then a section where the road disappears inside the, the hill and basically the data is not reflecting the actual embankment or the cuts of the roads uh, inside the, through, through these uh, yeah, kind of like waves of, of the topography. So how do we deal with that? So the first thing uh, we have to do is uh, we actually have to um, close the DGM. And in this process, the program will calculate the, the digital ground model. And then uh, we'll use the sides of the road to estimate the embankment, the cuts, and so forth. So what I did is I have a... Um, um, a geo file called road embankment so I'll select that so here is where the elevation lines to the right and left of the road and then at the top and at the bottom of the embankment will be uh, uh, developed and then also saved um, any data that is within this range uh, will be deleted so any topographical information will be removed and uh, then the next uh, thing that I need to do is I need to select the road so I'll um, zoom in here and uh, select the road here so here is the road and let me select the road alright so now the road is selected for the entire uh, path here and uh, we go to geo tools and here we have create embankment the embankment can be created also for rail systems so we define the slope to the right and left, uh, either in a cut or if it goes up the hill uh, in a berm. Um, so here I'll select a uh, cut uh, or a race over run of uh, a factor of two. So it, uh, the run is two and the rise is one. Uh, we can define uh, on the edges of the road how far we want to go for any kind of embankment. So I'll go for another three meters to the right and left in addition to the width of the road and then there's the same thing also you can do for like a rail uh, distance to the axis and then a certain delta so I'll click OK and uh, the process is running so the program will generate first a digital terrain model for the entire area and then it will check in terms of the embankments uh, what area needs to be deleted uh, to uh, calculate uh, the, the top or the bottom of the embankment. For this uh, project uh, it will take uh, maybe one or two minutes to actually calculate this and uh, again uh, what the program will save away is the an elevation line to the right and left of the road uh, basically where the embankment starts and then uh, either at the, at the slope top or the slope bottom uh, and a second line. So here we can maybe zoom into one of these areas. So here we have, you can see uh, the, the cut. So uh, all the elevation spot heights uh, were removed uh, between the uh, elevation line at the top and at the bottom. And the bottom is basically at the road. I can uh, maybe create a um, uh, uh, a temporary DGM to visualize uh, what the program did. So let me calculate that. And then I'll show you what, uh, what the changes are. 
And again, here the data, the elevation lines were saved in a um, separate um, geofile, and this geofile is called road embankment. So here is uh, now the uh, the three D view of this situation. You can kind of like see that on one side uh, we have uh, like the increases, and then here we have the cuts into the mountain hill. Here's a bigger cut. And then here we have an embankment. So right here we have embankment. Here is a, a cut. Here are some cuts. And uh, here's a smaller cut here into this mountain area and so forth. So again this was all automated uh, through this uh, create embankment calculation. So let me close this and uh, let's just look at this uh, geofile here, uh, current geofile. So here this is what is saved as the embankment. Uh, so we have the right and left of uh, the road and then uh, we also have the top or the bottom of the embankment. Thank you for listening.